Well, after turning the game back on again, it gave me a update for something. Said update is probably years old by now, but hey. <laughs> Hi, I'm Game Guy. It's time for oh more boy. Let's Play Ratchet and Clank into the Nexus. Infestation. Only a slight infestation. You, you, it should be said. Yeah, I'm sure this doorway needs to move all the way to the other side. It is. Why is there a timer? I mean, okay. I was gonna say, is that a timer for this thing to close? All right, cool. My ammo is full. For what reason is this being stated? No one knows, truly. But it's fine. It seems we've got ourselves a maze of some sort. I just shot a thing. I didn't mean to do it. Well, any ideas? We should look for signs of Pollux's equipment. If he used draft targets to move across the ruins, we may be able to trace them back to his location. Maybe. Oh good, we got a time limit. That's always my favorite. Is this a death pit or is there stuff down there? I will never know. Um, it's possible that I will never know. Will I know? The world will never know. There probably is stuff down there, but who knows, man. I, I certainly don't. Let, okay, look. Now that I'm not on a time limit, let's look. That looks decidedly like a possible death pit. So I'm gonna go ahead and continue on my merry little way. Why are there so many purpley wisp things all over the world? Who put this rhino schematic here? It's true. You're alive. Oh yeah, I was fixing up the old nebulox vault when boom, the lights went out. I tried to leave, but wouldn't you know it? <laughs> Locked. I don't suppose you'd be of any assistance. Do not worry. We will come to your aid as soon as possible. Oh, thanks, little fella. I'm not gonna lie. I completely forgot the plumber was even on that ship. <laughs> But okay, um, I mean, I'm not surprised he's alive, that's for sure, but hey, something just sparked. Who dares spark in the middle of the night? It was not me. Something's happening. Rocks are falling. It's a good time. Without the good times. And times can only be good when they're not bad. It is a proven fact. I just noticed there's, like, fish skeletons... Just kind of hanging here. Actual bones. That's a spine. Those are more bones. That's mildly upsetting. But it's fine. Because you see, I am Ratchet. I am the hero of this story. And as a result, it is impossible for me to die. Literally impossible. I mean, look at how much health is around here. Look at this blue stuff. I, I, for some reason, I thought it would actually damage me. And I was going to play it off like a joke. But uh, it didn't do it. It didn't do it. Hello, guys. You are here. You know what? I never actually used the nightmare box on purpose, so let's see what that does. Oh, no! That's... Oh, oh is it just a distraction? I guess that makes sense. So it's like the decoy glove, then. Maybe not the decoy glove. It's probably the wrong comparison. There, There's a comparison I'm trying to make here, and I don't remember what it is. You there, everybody, get out of the my face region. Thanks for that. Either way, I mean, I was right. It's a distraction of some kind. So. I, I don't know. I don't know what I was expecting it to do, to be fair. I just don't know. I've not played this game before, in case you forgot. <laughs> All right, well, everything is no longer dark and scary, but there is a ship. Hello, ship. <laughs> Goodbye, ship. I'll see you later, probably. It'll be a fun time when that happens. Gotta look around for secrets, because they exist. Secrets are my favorite look, pastime. Thug dropship. Let's follow it and see if it leads us to Pollux's lab. Okay, how do I get there? Do I just hover down? I guess I just hover down. Like, I, I saw that, that grav target thing over there, so I'm like looking for another one, but there was not another one. Oh no! It's those guys! I hate those guys! I'm using all of my blaster shots just Ow. to kill them. Pollux's grab targets are everywhere. We must be getting close. Be careful. The 
twins kidnapped him six months ago. Who knows what they've been having him work on? It's true. His bolt's just kind of floating in the air here. It's fine. So it looks like it wants me to do something. Well, now there's bolts up there. I want to see what is up there, because that just seems suspicious to me. Um, I need to get into you. Hello, I am now within the gravity stream. All right. Is that it? This is just a box. I mean, I, for some reason I figured, but it's like, you never know. Can I actually hit you from here or do I have to? Uh, all right, fine. I'll do it the intended way. Gosh, I hate everything. Everything is bad in this universe. All right, well, let's just go ahead and, oh no. Guys, have a nightmare box. That's my favorite box. Yeah, I think it's just a distraction. Oh, I guess you know what it's comparable to then? It's comparable to the, the freaking Groovatron. No, actually it is functioning like the decoy glove. So never mind, I was correct the first time. <laughs> it, it seems like a temporary distraction at first though. Also, I'm very noticeable that um, these guys are throwing projectiles with shock waves, by the way. I'm pretty sure that's something I should have noticed many a time before, but I didn't. Because I'm a rebel, that's how this works. There is health and such over there. I may want some of that. Possibly. It is entirely possible that that's a thing I want. I thought there was a box here. Am I just making stuff up? It happens from time to time. Time to time, hiccups help! Help, there are hiccups, they're on the rampage! They're going to destroy all of us! We need to find shelter! We need, we need to activate the emergency system siren system! It's the system where there's a siren and an emergencies. I don't know what it does, but it probably does something. What does this do? I was gonna say, that probably moves that thing. Fine. If you say so, okay, so what I need then, got myself 30 seconds to do this. I need this to be reset so that I can go the other direction. Ah, yes. Secretly, I am good at puzzles. Hello. Oh, you got a turret. Well, that's just rude. Have a nightmare box. I don't know what it's gonna do for me in this situation, but I mean, you never know. Sometimes, sometimes nightmares are truly helpful. Isn't that right, Mr. Friendly Fella? It's totally right. So there's a health crate there. I broke it. I, are you sure I don't have a box breaker? I, I feel like I have a box breaker. At, at least like a minimal effect area or something. Cause like, I just, it seems like I'm breaking boxes, like, super easy, out of nowhere. Actually, it occurs to me I'm gonna need to go through there, because there's the turret and the thing. The turret and the thing! My health is full. For the record, in case you there's forgot. There's gotta be a way through this grate. Yeah, I never would have guessed what the, the way through the grate could possibly be. Couldn't be that. Nope, not at all. Thank you, Clank Light. I needed you. We're at Pollock's lab. Lab of Darkness. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What? We're here to rescue you, but you need to tell us what the twins have you working on. It is nothing. It's just this pet project I had back at the office. Certainly nothing illegal. Just a tiny, insignificant... Trans-dimensional portal device. What sort of trans-dimensional portal device? Oh, man. What's going on down there? Nerd yeah, stuff. I'm uh, hosting my book club. You want to join? Uh, uh, no. As you were. Book club by yourself? I mean, all right. That's believable. Come on. We don't have a lot of time. We'll have to do this quickly. Begging your pardon, but do what quickly? This. What 
did you do to him? Ben's dimensional software upgrade. Time gonna have to give you a crash course. I'm sure we have time this for this. This entire planet is filled with dimensional rifts to a reality the twins call the Netherverse. Your upgraded spotlight uses irradiated particles to detect them. Irradiated particles? Is that safe? Oh, don't Probably worry. not. I'm perfectly safe as long as I stand far, far away from your incredibly radioactive body. <laughs> At least he's honest. <laughs> there is always that. I couldn't help but notice the uh, the boxes there, but I also noticed this rift. Do I just walk closer, or what's what am, what am I supposed to do here? Okay. Clank, do a thing. Oh, this is how we're gonna do our clank sections. You just crossed into a new reality. These dimensional rifts were created long ago by the explosion of the Great Clock. Now you can use them to cross into and out of each reality. Okay, enough exposition. Let's test out your new firmware. Push the uh, uh, manipulate gravity. Okay, I tried that like three times and it didn't work, but all right. Energy signature in your vicinity. Keep going. Oh, it just, okay. When it says push down, I thought it meant like click in the button, but no, that's not it. All right, we're playing. We're playing v v v v. Cool, my favorite video game. V v v v. I think I did it right. It said something about triangle, but I don't I don't know what that meant. Hey look, a friendly friend. Look, a nether. One of the indigenous creatures of this reality. See if you can lead him back to the rift. Why? Why would I do this? Something tells me I He's sleeping. You walk over there and smack him. But oh why? Of course. Cool. Also, I just realized I can go on horizontal surfaces. I didn't realize that before. Good job. Now lead the nether back to the rift. Its energy signature will set off a violent earthquake. Okay. What purpose will that serve? None. I've been here six months. I'm bored. Fair enough. Nice work, pal. Cool. The test is a success. You were born for interdimensional travel. So the Zarkov sector is not haunted. These ghosts are actually nethers. Those antennas we've been seeing around the city. Think those have something to do with all this? Their rift begins. Vendra's personal design. I just saw her in the orphanage a few hours ago working on this uh, thing. Never mind. Yeah, never mind. I believe you instantly. Am I back in the room with the questionable death pit? Turns out, there's three boxes down here that I missed. Man, I could have missed out on those, and it would have been a sad day. Also, there's a rift here somewhere, I guess. Oh. Alright, cool. I'm glad I turned the internet back on so that could interrupt my video. Thanks! Thanks, technology! You're great! Everybody freaking loves you, technology. Without question. Oh, okay. Gravity manipulation affects boxes, too. What does is, what is circle do? Oh, okay. I can push and pull it. Got it. Got it. I understand how this works. All right, box. I need you to get on here. All right. Boxes aren't affected by gravity, provided they're on a button. That's all I... Oh, I don't want to go that way. I thought there might be ground there. It turns out there was no ground. Ground ground is a myth. It's, it's, in a, it's just not a factual thing, you know? Just, if there were something that one could possibly construe as ground, they're just making it up, clearly. There, there's, there's no such thing. Why was I shifted gravity-wise? That shouldn't happen. Something's happening over here, though. Why, yes, that is the portal I entered from. I never would have guessed. All right. What exactly is it I'm supposed to do from here, then? 
guy? I don't know. I am unaware of the things that I am supposed to do. But it's fu Oh, I'm gonna have to do this shenanigans. That's cool, but alright. Need to get this guy off of my tail long enough to pull his box. Box, I need you on the thing. It's important, because otherwise I might die. And uh, dying, typically a bad thing. I was gonna say, if I just outrun it, is that gonna... Is that gonna work? Good work, pal. Alright. I opened it up. I did it. Look at all of the open I did. I, there, I saw like a flashy light down here, but it didn't, it didn't do anything. Or it was the health crate. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I have no knowings. There's, there's a bolt crank though. That's fun. Ah, yes. A swing shot target. Do I have a swing shot? Okay, I guess I have a swing shot. Game is only now telling me. Granted, I haven't needed to use it before now. Sure you were. <laughs> I believe you instantaneously. That's where the weapon vendor is. Orphanage should be this way. Oh, is this basically a I'm checkpoint curious. then? What kind of device do you think Pollux was helping them work on? Got me. That riff cracker he gave you only seems to work on robots. Maybe he was trying to figure out a way for everyone else to go in. Or come out. Stop trying to make plot things. There's this over here. Audio journal? Heck yeah! That's odd. Yo, orphanage. Bunch of creeps and bullies. All they do is pick on that for me. And when I tell one of the teachers, I get sent to detention. But I meet a new friend today. I call him Mr. I. And he lives in the caves where my brother and I were found. He doesn't pick on me. He says he's my friend. And he says he has big plans for us. It appears to be some sort of hollow diary. Vendra must have kept them while she was a resident here. Let's see if we can find some more. Yeah, that was... That that was oddly a specific thing to find. Also, thank you for lasting longer than allowing me to even go to the vendor guy. Because, you know, I wanted to, to do that. Oh, I have to hit R1 to go to upgrades. I can't just go down to go to upgrades. That'd be stupid. Do I want to max out the uh, rare titanium on this thing? I mean, I could get both of the hidden upgrades, actually. I might just go ahead and do that. Yeah. Let's do that. Quantum Blast? Heck yeah! Okay, sends enemies flying? Cool. I love it when my enemies go flying. What can I get with, like, one point? <laughs> Not much, turns out. Um, hmm. Bomb is doing pretty good. Nightmare Box could probably use something, but... The ghoul gets tougher or further away. And also ammo. Eh, tougher seems nice. I'm curious what the upgrade could be for that, because I don't have anything in the Nightmare Box right now. It's fine. Um, I need to go up there. Ow. That was very rude of you, everybody. Very rude indeed. Making me waste four shots on, like, three dudes. That's just the ultimate in rude-itude. The ultimate. As it turns out. So, like, does the upgrade mean the enemies get knocked back more or something? I guess that's what it means. But we made it to an orphanage or something. I guess we're gonna go here next time. Because, you know... When I think Ratchet and Clank, I think going to orphanages that may or may not be haunted by interdimensional beings. That's what I think of. And I'll see you later. Goodbye. The heck is this music?